Hey y'all, what's going on? I'm coming in here yet again. Y'all already know. With yet another wig. Yet another wig review. Now, this is a new brand. I've never tried them. I've never, uh, actually, I hadn't heard of them uh, until recently. Bishi is the brand. Bishi. And this is the Arrow wig. I have her in a number one. Now, she is a full cap. She's a synthetic unit as well. And let me just say that because if any of you ladies are interested in it, and it might make you more interested. Right now on uh, HerWigHarlem.com, they have her for $15.92. And I will post all information below. I will have a direct link that will take you directly to her. So let's get right into Miss Arrow. And so I already got my cap and everything on. So let's see. And I'm curious to check out the brand to see how the hair is. And of course, you know it's synthetic and it is a full cap. So this won't be too long a video. Um, she came packaged very nice. I, they did have great shipping. And so far, great customer service. So let's see. Hmm. I kind of wish I... Let me show y'all what she looks like. Now, I'm loving this color, but they didn't have that color. And that's what she looks like. And on the inside, it just tells you how to, you know, wash her and how to take care of her, you know, and all of that. So that's what comes inside. They also sent me another product, which I am going to I, I can't wait to like do. I seen another video from another uh, lady here on the YouTube and she was talking about the straight edge pomade and that's what this is. And she was just talking about how well it works for your edges being natural and also if you wear lace front wigs and things, how it just kind of helps in that area. So when I do, you know, another, um, I guess, lace front or whatever video, I will talk a little bit more about it. But this is it. And it's called Straight Edge. And I would say that this would work really well for sisters who are natural. And it, you know, to smooth your edges down, like if you're doing a half wig or something like that. You know, now this is the two ounce jar, which you get a lot in it, I think. Well, you can't even see it. It's white. But you get a lot in it. Let's see how it feels. Let's see. Not too heavy. Not really, really heavy. I mean, I would say it's about the same consistency as um, QPC and uh, Black and Sassy. So, anyway, I wanted to mention that as well. So, let me get Miss Girl out of the wrapper and see how Miss Arrow is. Get my scissors. Let me get my scissors here. My trusties. I try to keep them somewhere near try to let's cut off oh I think my sisters is getting done y'all and as always I keep the tag so that I can start just for storing purposes so I'll know what's in it because sometimes I can't get the you know this wooden part or this paper part to go back in so I keep this for storage so I will know exactly what wig it is in case you know you just put it in like just back in the plastic yeah. Okay, y'all. So let me get let me show you all how she looks on the inside. Of course, in the back, she has just your regular webs across the back. Um, she also has the adjustable straps in the back. There are no combs because this is a full cap, so this is just your basic, you know, just wig cap, and I call this the girdle material. <laughs> So, it's no combs or anything in the front. But, of course, you know that if you want to, you know, and she doesn't feel secure once you do the tabs, you can also do some bobby pins as well um, just to um, secure her even more. So, I'm going to adjust the straps here. And uh, hopefully I won't do it too tight because I can't stand the wig headache. Okay. And you know my mirror is over here on the side, so. All right, let's see here. All right, Miss B. She. 
Okay, y'all. So this, I'm having a Wheezy Jefferson moment. Y'all know how it is when I put the short wigs on. Right off, I go into Wheezy Jefferson. I get to having a Wheezy Jefferson moment. I can see. Oh, oh, they do have the little adjustable tabs on the side. Y'all know I like those. It just kind of secures it. Okay. All righty. Let's see here. I'm going to try to put her down, but I can see that she does have a cone head, although it may have a lot to do with just how much is, you know, up in the crown area. It could be that, but she does have a slight uh, cone head, just a slight cone head. So I'm going to spray her with a little wig luster so I can kind of work with her. Give me a big comb here. And let me look at how they have her. Okay. Okay. Well. Hmm. Let's see, y'all. Let's see what we can make her do. Let me see. I'm try to make her do what she do. Okay. I'm really up. Oh, well, wait a minute. I do see some possibilities, y'all. Y'all know every now and then I got to kind of look in the look at the camera and see what I'm working with. Like my mirror is not telling me the real truth about this wig. And I'm assuming that that's kind of going to go that way. I'm just kind of trying to get the hair to get in line and be where it's supposed to be. Don't be difficult. Okay, now I do believe, yeah, this is supposed to be in like your eye. And I think instead of having her like uniformed and that way, I think it's better to kind of like spike her over the eye. But maybe not. Let's see how they have her. But they don't really give me the, I don't know, that kind of looks raggedy. So let's see what the uniform look looks like. Kind of, And I think she is kind of cut that way. Was she supposed to kind of give that look? Okay. Hmm. Y'all know when I'm kind of on the edge with a wig or not. Kind of know when I'm there with it. Okay, what did I do there? Okay, did y'all see that piece of hair just go in on me? <laughs> get my brush here to see if I can get that to kind of stay down and be a little tame for me. See that piece of hair right about there. And some of the Y'all excuse me, that's Brent Becker. He knows I'm doing a video. But y'all know life goes on. Life goes on, honey. Am I missing any? Okay. That piece right there is just trying it with me. And I'm wondering which way she needs to go. I want her to be like the way she's supposed. Oh, okay, look. Look, piece of her. 
Now, that might be my only problem with this wig or this bishi. Okay, there we go. Well, it turned out it wasn't a problem. Now, I will say... Miss Arrow. I think I'm gonna have to just take some scissors and get that little piece that's right there. Y'all see that piece that's just sticking up? Let's see. And I just probably made it worse. Oh, seriously. Sorry, y'all. It's just really trying it with me. I got to pull my mirror up on this to get the hair just seems to want to kind of do what it wants to do but it's not going to happen like this as always with a wig you wear the hair don't let the hair wear you just got to kind of get her going here let me also say this by pulling this up closer and getting close to it this hair and even though it's a synthetic unit, y'all, this hair is like the yakky like type of texture. It really does mimic like permed hair. Now, I don't know how the longer ones are, but this one clearly, you know what I'm saying, could be easily, you know what I'm saying? This could actually be, you know, my own hair or whatever the case may be, you know, easily. It could be. So, and I'm sorry, y'all. Just had to move my my uh, mirror where I could come a little closer and try to get those little strayaways that I got here. So, all right, y'all. I like it, Miss Arrow. I am. I do. I like Miss Arrow. Let me fix that. Uh, it's a little bit better there. Make it a little bit more uniform. Um, it looks like she's got a little streak there, but I know she's a number one. But I like Miss Arrow. And I just brushed that and pulled that back, didn't I? Okay. Well, I am feeling Miss Arrow. Y'all tell me what you think. I will tell you that this hair does not remind me of synthetic hair at all this is feels and looks like now i don't know if y'all can see that but it's just like a yakky like type of texture to it <clears throat> and you know you don't have to put your wig on the way they have it you wear your wig how you want to wear it especially when you're dealing with like a shorter cut or any of them really you put it on the way you want it on like i said you know, you wear the hair, don't let the hair wear you. Period. Period. And that's it. And on that note, y'all, y'all know when I just stepped back looking at that, that made me want to just kind of throw my, my stunners on one time. Oh, maybe these are too big for the <laughs> I have to get another pair of these stunners on but i will say that i absolutely do like this wig i just probably will mess with her a little bit more and you know and really you don't have to mess that much i won't say that it's a shake and go because by being uh you know a shortcut and you want to get the hair the way you want it to be um the hair the um back is tapered y'all know i'm in this wheelchair so I can't really get all the way around, but the hair is tapered, and that's how it looks in the back. I will have to wait and see how it shows up on the video before I know fully. But I like Miss Arrow, and I do. I can say that I like the Bishi brand. Um, I would definitely, and I just love the fact that it's, y'all, I just wish y'all could see this because it, it just looks like permed hair. Seriously. It seriously does. It looks like permed hair. Although it is synthetic hair, it's that yakky texture. She looks like permed hair. Now, I will be turning this girl inside out to get that hump out of her. 
So don't let that hump intimidate you nor keep you from trying to get this wig because Miss Arrow is cute and she can be worked to death, honey. You know, just I just feel like I need to turn her inside out. You know what I'm saying? And get her together. I'm trying to see which side I like the best, y'all. Which, you know what I'm saying? Which side I'm feeling. So y'all tell me what y'all think. Like I said, this came from, and I want to make sure I say it right because I said it wrong to someone, herwigharlem.com. And I will put all information below. I will definitely say that this wig will get two thumbs up. I do like her and I love the texture of the hair on this wig. I haven't tried the longer wig, so I don't know about that. But this shorty do, y'all? Yeah, I'm kind of feeling her. I am feeling how I like her. So, y'all, let me know what y'all think. Be brutally honest. Y'all know I want y'all to about the comments. Tell me what you think, whether you like the wig on me or not. And like I said, I like it. I do like it. So, I'm out of here, y'all. Be sure to check out her wig Harlem. I hope I said it right. Her wig Harlem. I did. Okay, girl. Her wig Har Harlem. I will have everything below. Check them out. They do have some great prices. Shipping was super fast and all of that. So y'all check them out. Do yourself a favor and go better. Um, they do have some really, really good prices. And try out the Bishi bread. You know, so I think I want a long one now. So I'm out of here, y'all. Much love.